Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 267. Patent Ductus Arteriosus. Describe what is patent ductus arteriosus. In fetal period, there is a shunt that happens right to left, which is a normal condition. So there is blood that goes from the aorta to the pulmonary artery, and this is a normal situation in the fetal period. Now, in neonatal period, lung resistance decreases and shunt becomes left to right with subsequent right ventricular hypertrophy and or left ventricular hypertrophy and failure. This is an abnormal situation. What kind of murmur is heard with a patent ductus arteriosus? Patent ductus arteriosus is associated with a continuous machine-like murmur. What drugs allow you to keep the patent ductus arteriosus open? Patency is maintained by prostaglandin synthesis and low oxygen tension. What NSAID can help you close the patent ductus arteriosus? The drug that can help you close the PDA is indomethacin. A note about patent ductus arteriosus is that PDA is normal in utero but normally closes after birth. What happens if a PDA is not corrected? Uncorrected PDA can eventually result in late cyanosis in the lower extremities. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.